everybody i am sacred and they hardly welcome to you all and thank you for joining me you know let's play for joining us you now let's play of hearts of iron 4 and in the great war mob as the mighty german empire so всем привет дорогие друзья меня зовут сакрет и давайте поиграем дим победы 4 за германской империи на первой мировой войне well I need to excuse myself for not making videos for nearly two days. I was really busy in the time. I had no time for videos, but now, in the following days, I can promise you that we'll have videos on my good basis again. So please accept my excuse. I really wanted to make, but the time was against me. Therefore, let's get into the game and see how the German Empire uh, we control vast areas of Africa. Africa is. Basically under our control fully. Yeah, it is. Let's say it like that. Only that Spanish colonies aren't as well as Liberia. Continue our game. Yeah, we have no music. Let's get some music up. There we go, some German Imperial music. Okay, we got the advanced hand tools. That's good for our industry. Let's see what can be other again efficiency, construction speed, yeah. Basic basic machine tools are still twenty years ahead of time. So we can do the tree as well, but that's even twenty-seven years ahead of time, so that's not a option right now. Yeah. I need to build better ships, therefore well I can make a huge upgrade in nineteen twenty two. That's the thing. I can build some carriers. Carriers, nineteen twenty two carriers, seaplane carrier. I see. Dollar cruisers, let's build some light cruisers, yeah, light cruisers. Only 49 cruisers. Yeah, I question the motives of Sweden. We have three free military factories. And we'll need, yeah, we have 110,000 surplus of infantry equipment, that's okay. We need sport equipment, sport equipment. Well, let's queue in sport equipment. Sport equipment and queue it in maximum. It can stay down below there, I don't mind anymore. Anti tank warfare is done. Let's complete our tree here. We are getting into armored warfare. Let's upgrade our. Yeah, let's adopt the Stahlhelm. And look to the war against the Swiss. Let's go explanedly. Here we captured vast areas of, of the Swiss industry. Did we? Yeah, we did actually. Let's check here. They have um, one military factory and six civilians. We have to overrun them, let's overrun this area. No problem is our troops won't push anymore. I'll tell them to push. Uh, the problem is, yeah, that's the pushing. Yeah, we have to just capture Zurich basically. Zurich, after the capture of Zurich, the enemy should capitulate. That makes a major pressure on the front. We have to insect the Zurich in order to get the Swiss, but the Swiss shouldn't be a problem after all. Let's miss these results. Oh, there is the uh, Japanese army. I don't know why the Ottomans are so horrible bad at protecting their own area. That's simply disgusting. Let's send these Austrian troops into that area. Here you go. They are going alright. This is a battle plan to capture Arana. Seems alright. Then. I get in the position and then crush that Japanese invasion force, which is unbelievable that they even exist. The Russian civil war is still ongoing with no winner in sight. I'm really well excited to see how long the civil war will actually last. Interesting. I wanna finish. I wanna. Well, I want them to finish the civil war first before I make any further advancement. Let's see the thing. Here, yeah, where does the... Oh, we have quite a high level of resistance. Resistance here. Yeah, we can't cross Sicily, but we don't even need to. Don't even need to, that's the thing. We have 24, because of that strong navy, I'm gonna send them close to Naples. After that, I don't know where the allies aren't capturing Palermo. We have, we still control Palermo, so that's the allied mistake. Uh, yeah, we need more troops down below here. Occupying the area. Yeah, I'll tell these 19 Bulgarian troops to do the occupation of Italy. So they'll go into Italy. Come on. There we go. Bulgarian troops. Ah. Huh. Now the Greece. 
the Greece, the Greek are also getting stronger and stronger. I mean, they are authoritarian, so they won't join any faction. I have no problem with them being authoritarian. They feel threatened, but they... Well, they might join our faction. Let's guarantee their independence. Okay, we got the cause belly. I don't know for what, though. Okay, we can do Zeppelin campaign. Ask... No, they don't need that. Go, yeah, go here. I need to go for the armament efforts. Well, I need to do all of these four. That will take a long time until we get four research slots. I can tell you that. A long, long time it will take. Alright, well. We'll call this belly against whom? Against... Oh, Persia? Against Persia. The Persian army is two divisions strong. Well, okay. I need to send troops into Persia then. Yeah, we didn't catch up the Danish yet. Let's all run the Danish army here. Are we attacking through... Uh, why can't we attack them all? They are low supply. Oh, they did encircle us, is that the thing? They did encircle us, really? They did truly encircle us, I can't believe it. Okay, that's problematic, so... Let's get a dockyard up there quick in Sealand. I did really encircle us here, these troops. Oh, that's the problem here. I need to send a quick relief force. I have 13 German, well, these are bad German troops. Able to do nothing. I'm gonna combine these armies, and yeah, they will be the relief force. Relief force. That's it, yeah. And against Persia, 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 here I have still uh, resistant occupation in lots of provinces. I mean, you go into Palermo. They are moving in great. Okay, then that should be fixed, the problem. Here. My troops are doing a superbly job of guarding. I f don't think. I need that many even troops to guard 65. I'm gonna get the half of them away from there. Send them all into a port and then they will go into where? Into where will they go? Into Persia, yeah. So go to the port of Dover. <coughs> These 33 divisions. Here. Ost Asian. Let's add them into the Asian front. Asian front. Asische, Asiatische, Asiatische, not Asische, that's not even a German word, huh? Army group Italy can be disbanded, well, let's get them into the simply Balkan army. Alright, our army is 5 million men strong, oh, that's good, that's good. Our relief, okay, we did capture them already, therefore, the battle for Copenhagen. Yeah, let's wait for our troops to get uh, resupplied fully. Yeah. To get reorganized and resupplied fully. Well, we can send these 29 divisions. 29 divisions into war. Let's send them as well as into the Asian front. A rapid deployment mode. Okay, and these troops can finally disembark from the British Isles. Back to the German Firelands. There we go. Our troops did land in Palermo. That's great. Assign them and tell them to push into Messina. Get them a. Okay, fine. A general from Blaskowitz. But Switzerland has capitulated. The Swiss did capitulate. That's superb. Now we can relieve our whole other group Italy as well and send it into the Asian battlefield, because we'll conquer the British Rye as well, and start our conquest from China from that point. So I want a quick advancement, quick and rapid advancement. I'll get some divisions to guard the Swiss area though. Uh, that amount should be fine, like, let's see let's say. That's all stupid. While the rest of my force here should be called Army Group Persian, which stands for Persia.
Not Persian. Persian. Yeah, not the football player. Alright, Persian. You'll rapidly de deploy yourself against the Persian border. And the Austrian troops can execute. Yeah, and crush the Japanese remnants. Alright, that's great. The Ottomans control the area of that province as well. It's okay, that's good, that's good. The Portuguese captured that area, that's, well, surprising. Naval battle. Naval battle, why? Against, okay, I see. 84 close their sports against the fleet. Yeah, the French and English fleet still exist, that's the problem. <coughs> let's see if I can do the invasion of Dublin. Yeah, let's start. Okay, five more days still, five more days. Alright, I need to move the latter austro hungarian troops here. Yeah, 10 out of 24. 32 troops. I don't know how it's gonna look like, so I don't think I can succeed with the invasion this time. We will <coughs> war goal against Persia, I know that. Let's speed things up. Yo, yeah. Empire of Japan is no more. There we go. And these Portuguese units can also get destroyed fully. Yeah, they are dead already. Okay, I want full control of the Swiss industry. Full control of the Swiss industry. Therefore, I have to go to manage occupied territories and go to Switzerland. Switzerland, where are you? <coughs> Harshest policy. <coughs> now let's see how the Swiss will react to this. Uh, it's still only 4%, that's minus zero. I can send one cavalry division into there. So that's why Strasse Panzer Oh, it's fine, great. Our industry is simply the strongest of all. What else do we wish, do we? Our troops are still on the way into the Persian battlefields. Let's see, yeah, the Anton still controls vital areas of Asia. Well, China is the main problem here, China. <coughs> but so the Chinese army is health strong. 28 to 90 divisions. That's not so. That's now not strong at all. We have 5.1 million troops. As well as a superb supply of infantry equipment, sport equipment, field guns. And perhaps we need more field guns as well. That's the problem. I need Mexico to join me. I need Mexico to join my faction. They're also terrorists, but they really don't want to join. Maybe they'll join... Yeah, when can I make the cinema telegram? After the 1st January of 1917. Then. I'm gonna take your divisions, why not? Three civil factories. Um, okay, what do I want to build? I have 332... 30... 343... military factories. I can build more... military ones, yeah. You'll see the region can't take even more. That's the problem. Uh, uh. Yeah, the uh, lots of the regions are over their capacity already. Ha! Huh. Funny. Well, yeah, I will them in Poland, in, as well as in Ostpreußen. I'd say I'm not gonna make create a Polish puppet. Therefore, it will stay under German imperial hands. Free fuel factories. We can even build more. Are we that strong? Yeah. Apparently. Okay, let's see. Yeah. This area will all stay under my control. Now it, it should be fine, I guess. Yeah. Alright, there we go. Oh, yeah, there are lots of Italian divisions. They are being encircled. Let's tell the Austrians to attack as well. The encirclement of Messina. Infrastructure is. Yeah, well. 29 divisions. At least are 40 under Persian. I'm to line up and just to push against the Persian coastline. Let's see their battle plan. 
Seems okay. Yeah. Sweeping once throughout the country, that's alright. These Austro-Hungarian troops will do the same. While at least 29 troops will go against yeah, the Emirate of Nates. On the quick I want a quick victory against them. Do I have a cause belly? I don't I lost it. So I need to conquer it once more. It will take some time, but yeah, it's three military factories. I want more field cannons. Uh, where are they? Yeah, group, group field cannons, group quality, German quality. Yeah. Upgrade you in the group as well. The Ottoman Expeditionary Force. That's nice. Ottoman Empire. Here we control a non core population of 407 million. Well, that's a good thing, isn't it? The units there, they are still being encircled, although they are fighting quite well in Messina. We can't really <coughs> speak from an encirclement there. Alright, our troops are ready against the Persians. Did we kill the Cult's belly? So go and call allies, declare war. War is declared. And go and execute. Persia joined the Entente, but that won't help them. Here, yeah, that won't help them for sure. I need more uh, resistance occupation. Okay, they are ready, I forgot about them. The final attack on Copenhagen. Yeah, Yekaterino Slavo, I have way too many troops to spread out. Yekaterino Slavo, will go there. Well, if it's plus zero, uh, they are su sabotaging the infrastructure. I don't like that. In Kiev, zero, zero, zero. Uh, if it's zero, it's okay, I guess. Yeah. Move on into there as well. Okay. Let's check the army. Soviet Russian army 42 to 80. Uh, it's. I don't know. I really don't know. Almost the revolution. Here, the Russian Empire. <coughs> <coughs> well, Moscow is still far ahead, but. Weird. Look how fast we are advancing. It's simply a march here. We'll be marching through the territory. I'll tell these four divisions to spearhead their advance into Tehran. But Tehran isn't the only province we have to capture. Yeah. Stop. Okay. Yeah, the British right is helping them. Look to that. Of course they will. But won't they? <coughs> well, that's a rather blitzkrieg, I'd say. A blitzkrieg-like advance, if you ask me. Resistance to occupation. West Midlands. Oh yeah, let's start our naval invasion. And see how well or how bad it will go. We need air wings in the area. Do I have <coughs> planes? Yeah, I do. Great. Move them, although they are all of bait. Better than nothing. Move them into the British area. <coughs> Alright, still the effort is done. Let's continue with just yeah, something here. I don't mind what it is. Our planes waiting for all of us. They are still deploying from the reserve. Also, I don't need these plants anymore to be active. We got what we want. We must probably be handling the scars, yeah. The Zeppelin. Move the Zeppelin into the Greater London area. Three civilian factories, military factory. Yeah, let's maximize our military. Yeah, Ukraine won't be powered as well. Ukraine will be annexed fully. Therefore, we can yeah, we will this our own area now. Do I have some non port occupied areas here? Mm. Will be sent into there. I need as well the troops in Lugansk. You will go into there, fine. Alright, look to these here. Just dismiss them all at once. <coughs> Now we can deploy our planes. Finally. Western approaches. 
There we go. We control the area. Oh. As then approaches. Port strike as well. You do some Ireland. And the Zeppelin will just bomb Ireland. And go. Uh, we like sufficient intel. Why? Why do we? I assigned a wing already. What's the problem? Assign more air wings. I need to assign more air wings on the mission. Hmm, I don't get it. Why? It says we like sufficient intel. I don't get it. Do I need to assign even more air wings or what's the problem? Let's send yeah, more air wings into Britain than into the British airfields. Port strike isn't really going well, is it? Fine, let's dismiss you. I really don't get it. Why can't I invade them? Do I need to send my navy? But my navy will just get destroyed. Because it's so weak now. What well, Persia did Cambridge Valley already before we knew it. Yeah, apparently we can't go for the Western Approaches invasion. I don't know why. Therefore, I'll postpone the invasion of Ireland indefinitely then. Because it won't work. You see, we lack sufficient intel. Assign more air wings or missions or cover the area with radar. Okay, I see the problem. Well, then it's fine. Here, you'll be merged and just told to guard Britain. Yeah, just guard Britain. At least troops should be enough. I'm gonna combine the Austrian army with you as well. At least Austrian army. I didn't take all of them, did I? No. There we go. 66 divisions guarding the Austrian front should be alright. Okay. And I can build more military factories. What a surprise, is it? You maximize the Ukrainian region, then fine. <laughs> because I can't maximize my own region, it's full already. That's only a question of time until the Ukrainian region is full as well. I can't uh, maximize that region either. <coughs> funny, funny. I'll probably capitulate. We are in firm control of that area. Now, oh, my 40 troops will have the task to push into, well, the British Rye. Rush, Rye, call it whatever you want. Afghanistan, let's check the Afghan army. 6 to 12 divisions. They are authoritarian. Well, they have a neutral foreign policy and they will need their front, so I'm gonna justify against them as well. Yeah, that's what I want. Our losses are nearly 2 million already. The USA is the main contributor to the war, apparently. That's interesting. They're bombing us as well, it seems like, but I can't really see where. Here, yeah, 94. The battle is done soon of Copenhagen. Then the Danes are fully occupied. <coughs> Let's check where in the Greater London area. Is that a joke? Oh yeah, I have 33 divisions here. Let's ship them over. Liverpool. I need so many troops, so many bloody troops to cover the bridge area. That's unbelievable. We got the light cruiser now. I need more troops there. I can balance out manually. Minus three, minus four. So the way well, well, go for the yeah, the oil machine gun then, I guess. I'll go against Sweden. Yeah, we have to capture the Danish bronzes first. The Swedish army is non-existent. So it will be just a marching through. Look at that 16. Oh, that's the British Rye force. We are overwhelming them. Great, Denmark did capitulate, the Danish capitulation. 
I'm gonna give the Ottomans control of all Persia because, well, I don't wanna leave our allies without any gain. So, there we go. Look to the Ottoman Empire. Now they should be happy. But also guard the area. Can't be bothered with it. <coughs> Kenya, Hartum. Where's Uriyev? It's somewhere here. Well, it sounds... Targanarok. can send one division into Takanaro. Uriyev. That probably defense. Alright, fine. Our war is going splendid. Pushing into Balushistan. Let's get our air force into that area. Air force. Close air support. A long travel with the caravan. Got the dreadnought. Let's improve our naval doctrine now. Since we got the better dreadnought, I'm gonna produce him only. Of course, after the production of these is done. Yeah. I'll queue him in already just to ready himself. Dreadnought 3. <coughs> and deploy you in our. Well, area at Königsberg, Königsberg, Dreadnought 3, Dreadnought 3, just maximize those. Let's place them, Dreadnought and Dreadnoughts. Here, you're in the 1st November of 1916 and I will take a break here, I'll take a cut. So thank you all for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe to see more, I'm Sacred and I'm out, see you all next time.